What? Yeah? What? I know. I know, you're a crazy boy. You're being crazy. Hey everybody, Prepper Nurse One here. Today is February 3rd, it is Sunday, 2019. Absolutely beautiful, clear, clear blue skies today for a change, which is nice. Uh, the sun has been out. It is actually very warm for New York State. It's about 50 degrees, which is fantastic. What? I know, I see you. He is so funny, this cat. Uh, so, anyway, uh, jump right on the topic here. Situation going on where the president has stated now that uh, the option of uh, putting uh, troops are in play as far as the Venezuela situation goes, which I think is a terrible decision. Uh, come on, now that's enough, 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 go. Uh, so, it's, uh, you know, you're, 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 poking, you're poking Russia, and uh, there, there's a lot of grandstanding going on on both sides with Russia and us. Uh, I see that uh, Putin is pulled out of the IM, IMF. I think it's the IMF that he pulled out of. As far as the uh, the treaty, so it puts us basically right back into a Cold War situation, which is definitely not where we want to be. Uh, not good at all. Not good at all. And uh, it's a very bad situation. And I just I don't get what these people are doing. I don't know what the you know kind of games that they're playing. It doesn't make any sense to me. It really doesn't. Uh, you would think that they've evolved enough at this point to, you know, let me pull mine out and show who's bigger. I mean, that's what it seems like to me. It's just it's so stupid. And, uh, what? I see, I see you. I see you. Yes, I know, you crazy boy. This freaking cat's nuts. Anyway, uh, so, not a good situation with that whole thing. We need to, like I said, again, I've talked about this a little bit before, we need to mind our own business. I know some people are saying, well, it's right on our back door. Well, it's really not right on our back door. Venezuela's not on our back door. So, uh, you know, again, it just, and it, it comes down to, you know, minerals and oil and those type of things. And that's what uh, everybody's always concerned about. And uh, So I definitely want to hear what your guys' feedback is. What do you think about that option of uh, using troops? down there and getting that involved and escalating that I don't think that that's a escalating it is not the way to go I really don't I don't think that that is uh, definitely the way to go in that situation but uh, so uh, so anyway I definitely want to hear you guys feedback on that I'm not doing a live chat today I just uh, I still don't feel well and uh, I feel a little bit better but I just, I have just, this has kicked my butt. I mean, I've done nothing but sleep, so it hasn't been a whole lot of fun. Uh, but like I said, it's absolutely gorgeous out right now. I'm walking around here with a t-shirt on, it's like 50 degrees. So everybody talks, I had people ask me what this building is, okay? So I'm gonna take you over here and I'm gonna show you real quick. And you may hear it already. I fired it up just so that it could run for a while. This is my Harley. So, that's where she sits in the winter. She has her own little house. Obviously, got a bunch of other stuff stored in here as well. But, uh, yeah, this is where I, uh, I keep it in the wintertime. Just, uh, so I figured I'd just let it run for a little bit while I was doing this video. I can't wait for the weather to truly break and the salt to get off the road so that I can get out and ride again. I miss riding. It's one thing about living in New York. We're very limited during a season of how, how we can ride. So that's no fun. We're going to walk up here real quick. We're just going to take a look and see what the solar brought in today. Very sunny out. I mean, again, the sun is not super high in the sky yet. It's working its way up there. And the days are getting longer, which are nice. I mean, it doesn't get dark now until after 5. So, that's a good thing. 
But uh, yes, we had uh, a lot of melting going on as far as the snow, which is good. The more it melts, the better, as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> Not a big fan of winter, as you can tell. Especially the, the temperatures that we had here uh, earlier in the week it was not a whole lot of fun. Alright, so we're going to go in here and look. We're going to see what we got here. Wow, it didn't bring very much in today. I'm surprised actually. Because uh, it's really sunny out there right now. We got 0.6 on this one and 0.2. I think it's probably just because the sun's so low. So we got 0.8. I think we brought in 1.2 yesterday. I mean, it's still early. I mean, early enough. So, but uh, part of the problem that we're having with the solar system right now, and I'll show you, and uh, this, you know, was going on from last year. You guys want to go in? No, we'll wait. Um, this one corner of this panel is covered by a shadow from these ones here. So, I mean, this everything's going to get changed out to spring anyway. That's that's the game plan, okay? So, this is all going to come down, get all redone, and I can't wait till we can do that. That's going to be freaking awesome. It's going to be a lot of work, but it's going to be well worth it. And, uh, but yeah, everything's going to be adjusted. So because of that corner being covered and shadowed, it cuts down on the production of that that those three panels because they're all tied together. Those three are all tied together, so it cuts down on the production of those panels. So it's just, uh, eh, what are you going to do? It's uh, you know, it's part of the part of the game, I guess. But uh, the days are getting longer, which is good. What? You are something else today. You are something else, buddy. Yeah. So we got some melting going on here, which is good. So I actually see part of the driveway again, which is definitely a good thing. Uh, but we're getting there. It's, uh, you know, we're into February now, so we get through February. And, and like I said, getting some 50-degree days in February, I will take that every time. It's uh, definitely a good thing. So I am not going to complain. But... Uh, that time of year, we just kind of deal with it. So, anyway, guys, uh, that's what's going on here. Nothing super exciting. Uh, definitely look to hear what your guys' feedback is about the whole Venezuela situation, what you think about that. I am not thinking clearly, I'll be honest with you. My head is still pretty clouded. So, that's why, like I said, I, and like with the Super Bowl being on today and everything else, I just, like I said, I don't think I could sit for a whole hour and uh, do a live chat today. So, Hopefully by Wednesday I'll be better, and uh, we will we will continue that then. But uh, that's what's happening. Nothing super exciting. So I don't know if I I think I've showed you guys this before. So one of the guys in my group, Brian, he's got uh, this is one of his solar panels. He's going to be bringing more down this year to set up, and that uh, that runs his little batteries that he has inside the camper so he has power for the camper and uh, so he built that rack himself and he's going to have actually have another one so we put the concrete blocks down to get it up higher off the ground and uh, it works out really really well so it's keeping those batteries charged up good and uh, it's working out for him so that's a good thing but uh, yeah this year's going to be interesting we'll see what we can get accomplished this year I think it's going to be a good year I do uh, just got to get over to sickness. Like I said, I feel better, but I just, I'm still not even close to 100%. So I'm hoping in a couple more days I will be. Anyway, guys, I'm going to jump off of here for now. Uh, remember, guys, we are all in this together. That's important. Remember, I think a lot of people lose sight of that. And uh, so that's important. You know, we got to work together and try to help each other out if we can. Remember, hug and kiss the ones you love. Tell them every single day. Tomorrow is not guaranteed. We never know what's going to happen in life. So it's uh, important to remember that. And uh, to tell the people how you feel about them every day. To let them know how you care. I think that's so important. And, uh, and it's uh, STD. It's 
one step at a time, one thing at a time, and one day at a time. Whatever you're trying to do, whatever you're trying to accomplish, you can do it. The only one that's going to stop you from getting there is yourself, okay? Nobody else can do it, and that's it. I mean, that's the, that's it. I'm not, the only one that can stop you is you. So stay positive, stay focused, and you will do fine. And uh, I hope everybody has a great day. And uh, I'm going to pull for New England today just because I'd like to see Tom Brady get the sixth ring. That's the only reason. <laughs> so, all right, I'll see you guys later. Have a great day. Prepper Nurse 1, out for now.